everybody, it's Seth Jones, Editor-in-Chief of Landscape Management Magazine. I'm at Equip Expo 2023. I'm being joined by Chase 2 here at the John Deere booth. And Chase, you walk into the expo anywhere, and there's signs everywhere that says the new standard in mowing. I think yeah. that's a, What's the new standard? What, what's, what, yeah, what, the what new you... standard is our Q800 series uh, stand-on quick track launch. Uh, super excited. Been working on this for uh, about three years now. Uh, benchmarking all the great products in the market from our competitors, but also putting our own John Deere flair on it as well. So we're uh, super excited to be showing it here. Part of this lineup was at Elevate, but now they get the whole, you got a bunch of machines around me. Walk yeah. through about like what's, what's the whole crew looking like now? What do you, yeah, what do you so, so we start with our E-Series, which is kind of our traditional uh, kind of familiar machine. Uh, got two models there with a 36 and a 48. Then we step up to our M-Series where we've got a much bigger portfolio. It's kind of the heart and soul of the portfolio. 48, 54, 60. We got three different engine options available from carbureted to EFI. And then we go up to our R-Spec, which is our premium machine. Again, workhorse on the top end of the portfolio, really production focused. A um, couple of different horsepowers, 48, 54, 60 as well. And, um, you know, great features. We've got our seven iron deck on here that we've uh, we've never had on a commercial uh, stand on before or spent a long time. Uh, and then we've also got the new um, the new Kawasaki kind of 34 and a half uh, EFI Evo uh, as well. So yeah. So something for everybody. And obviously, obviously productivity is what it's all about. Yeah. What, what what would makes a guy choose between one engine to the next? And like when they come to you guys, what are some of the things they're asking you about? Like, hey, I want to get the job done faster. Do I just go for the bigger engine, or do I go? You know what? what you, you never buy too much horsepower. So. Okay, okay. <laughs> uh, yeah, we just want to give people one a variety of price points, right? Okay. So that the higher you go up, the, the more expensive it's going to be. Uh, but we also want to give people, hey, uh, you know, if, if you're cutting, uh, you know, cool season grasses, you know, the, the 23 and a half or the 27 is probably a good one. If you're in Florida cutting warm season grasses and primarily mulching, you're definitely going to need the more horsepower. Uh, the 34 and a half EFI Evo is probably a good fit for you. Or if you're just a customer that likes horsepower, we, we want to be sure and let you uh, be able to choose up and down the spectrum. So, okay, and yeah. it's all right here. Right it's all here right here, here, man. Okay, cool. Yeah, we're super excited. Good, good. Yeah. And all these people are going to come see you guys. It's going to be a busy week. Well, yeah, it is that. Well, Chase, appreciate you showing us around the booth today, and uh, congrats on the new lineup of mowers. Yeah, exciting. good to see you. Thanks for stopping by. Absolutely. Yeah. Hey, everybody, this is Chase 2 with John Deere. I'm Seth Jones, Landscape Management Magazine. Thanks for watching us here on Landscape Management TV. Come see us.